the window of the sizing template. What you see through the window is what will end up on the front of the envelope. Place the template on the paper and line up your image using the window. Once you have your image where you want it, tear the paper against the edge of the template. Simply pull the paper against the edge towards the center at a slight angle. You may be wondering about paper thickness. The key to tearing thicker papers like wallpapers is to hold your hand closer to the edge of the template and pull at a slight angle. Sometimes handmade papers present a problem because they have bark pieces in them. With these papers you can use a cutting knife or scissors to get a cleaner edge. Once you've finished tearing, you should have a piece of paper the same size and shape as the sizing template. First you rip it, then you flip it. Flip the paper over, the printed side should be face down. Then realign the sizing template so all the edges match, including the notched corner. Place the centerpiece template into the window. Remove the sizing template, then fold around the centerpiece. Fold the sides over first. Pull them snugly against the edge and crease them completely along the edges. Then fold up the bottom. The bottom is the one with the notch. Then fold over the top. Using a glue stick, apply some glue to the edge of the bottom flap. Make sure to apply glue all the way to the edge of the paper. Hold the sides together and secure the bottom. And don't forget to remove the centerpiece before mailing your letter. You can see how in just a few moments we transformed a piece of wrapping paper into a beautiful one-of-a-kind envelope.